Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into this. Thank you God for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message. All right, so let's see what's going on for you. All right, Cap. Let's see what's going on for you this week. Oh, let me read what I got for you off camera because I keep forgetting. All right, let's see. Okay, so no cooperation. Too extravagant or materialistic. Bad choices. Somebody's wanting to reconcile and come back together, but it's a lot of wishful thinking and procrastination. So let's see. Let's see what's going on for my Capricorns. All right, so community here. Um, so you could be listening to your friends, your family, the people around you, your community, um, people close to you. Um, they mean something to you, okay? Um, they come from all different walks of life. Um, the community, your family is coming together for some reason here also. Let's see. Let's see what's going on for my Capricorn. Okay. Courthouse. It may have to do some legal work or some legal paperwork or some tedious things. Um, it could be as simple as, you know, renewing your driver's license to getting a permit, a license, a business license or something of that nature here where you just got to go handle some business. OK, down at the courthouse. All right. Um, some of you could be getting married or you could be getting divorced or separated. Um, you could be getting advice or advised uh, of what to do or how to go about this high honor some of you could be getting married um maybe you got the marriage certificate now um now you are a different title you are a missus or a mister um here with the high honor here let's see um, a, a new pathway is opening up for you very good um things are working together this is what you have envisioned this was what you manifested this is what you saw for yourself let's see um, expectation yeah so you're expecting something to come in maybe come in the mail come to you um, you put something out um, and you're expecting a return here you're expecting for something to be completed um, some of you are expecting for somebody to stop cheating or lying or being just false altogether or you're gonna leave okay or there's gonna be some significant change that happens here um, cause there's no cooperation here. You, you stated your peace and now you want something to change, right? You can leave this marriage, uh, because it could be a third party within the connection here. Um, let's see. Yeah. And it, it's just too much work to deal with. It's too hard for someone to deal with. It's too hard for someone to actually get over. Let me do one more card here. Okay. Um, yeah, a child here. If someone else has a child, if there's a child born here, a secret child, a love child, an affair, um, someone could have got a message that there was a child here. Um, someone is divorcing or is thinking about it, is thinking about giving up on this connection, this relationship, because it's too, it's too burdensome. Someone was expecting someone to return, to come back, was to stop the, someone's expecting the other person to stop cheating, lying, um, to be honest, to come clean or, um, or they were leaving. Um, someone could have also left the house too, like moved out. Um, but you guys are still married. It's just becoming very hard to deal with. Um, a, a new beginning is on the horizons for you. Someone is acting very independent in a connection, in a marriage, okay? Uh, it's like every man, every woman for themselves right now. What's going on for my Capricorn? What's going on for my Capricorn? All right. Yeah, eight of fire. You could have had a conversation to bring something to resolution or conclusion here. Um, because there's a lot of obsession about not knowing. So it was like, let's clear the air. Six of cups, it could have been about a child or children or childbirth, or maybe someone from the past or another party or making a choice of what are you going to do, me or her, or her, him or her, or him or, I don't know, him or them. <laughs> yeah, are, are we divorcing? Are we staying together? Um, are you going to let this third party really um, disturb us, disturb our connection, our marriage, disrupt us? Is it over? Um, isolation, alienation here. Also, someone needs time to think about 
what to do because their heart is divided. They have love for both is what I'm hearing. Yeah, someone wanted to reconcile, but a lot of hesitation, procrastination is what we got in the pre-shuffle. This card says hesitated before making a decision here. It says that the relationship is recoverable, but you got to be willing to do the work. You got to be willing to meet the other person halfway, or you got to build the bridge back to them, especially if you're the person that messed up. Um, somebody's hesitating, though. Um, even shame, shameful here. Um, therefore, they, they moved on or moved out or they're choosing to move on um, quietly or by themselves or put themselves first. Once again, it's almost like an energy of every man, every woman for themselves here. Uh, one more card here. Yeah, all of a sudden here, um, things are breaking down. Things are, uh, are just not working out in this connection, in this relationship. Something got found out and then here comes the breakdown, all right? One card to clarify the tower. It could be dealing with the Scorpio here too. Um, sudden upheaval, feelings. This is also something that has historical value. I don't know if this person was dealing with this per same person before, or they had been cheating before. Yeah, the manifestation here. The manifestation was a new baby. Um, was something that they can't get rid of. It it's okay to cheat, but to have the manifestation be a, a child born it's hard for the other person to get over so the manifestation was something new something um that somebody started somewhere else okay and all of a sudden somebody found out about this uh they found out about a, a pregnancy okay uh, the beginning of a pregnancy here too um yeah w w like i said they can't get over it with the ten of swords here um the inability to cope the inability to cope with the fact that the relationship is over that this is the fullness of the thing that you're devastated blindsided um maybe being overly dramatic victimization you know i don't know so this is what i have for you cap if it resonates go over to the website book your own reading there to pull your own energy to see if this is your story um you can also text a question or two to the number below you could donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link thank you capricorn many blessings to you